All right, hey everybody, uh, another update here. David, you're a piece of shit still. Just, you're a piece of shit day to day. From the time you wake up to the time you go to sleep and all through the night, you're a piece of shit. This is just gonna be quick, guys, probably about five minutes. The, the, what I'm gonna get into here is one of the one of the characteristics of a destructive leader is the, is the, the thought manipulation and the thought reformation. Bruce Parkins put a, put a good point up here um i think he's new to the channel the whole clan are recovering this and recovering from that exodition ex addiction ex addiction ex prostitution abuse trauma ridden mentally ill etc etc this is what that ministry feeds off of they are easier to manipulate their thoughts and behavior david is satan's right hand man yes you're absolutely right about this bruce parkins this is one of the things i've been reading about and this is something that psychologists still are having a hard time understanding is the thought manipulation and the and the thought reformation of these cult leaders is how they do it and why these people choose to stick around. You know, um, it it really it really is kind of a scary thing to to know that there's people out there that prey on the mentally, you know, that people that have some kind of you know maybe mental disability. You know, and that's David. That's what you do, David. You're scum like that. You're a piece of shit like that. Is you're you're your your livelihood depends on you preying on the weak, weak-minded, elderly, infirm, people with drug addictions, people coming in off the street. Definitely. Um, and it it's sh it's shitty to see how how you actually put these members up to do your damage control for you because these people aren't going and doing this willingly you're, they're, you're putting them up to it David easily you can tell you can tell it's scripted everything you do about them is scripted David and that's shitty that you do that it's horrible that you're preying off the weak minded like that should be against the law for you to do that to manipulate the pe people with you know that might be dealing with some you know some sort of uh, you know meant it, it's it's shitty to think about it david it makes me sick to think that you that you prey on the weak and vulnerable <clears throat> so that was just a quick update i wanted to give you guys is that that whole thought reformation, Dave? That's part of your scam, and it's pretty it's pretty gross too. It's pretty disgusting that you do that. Um, that's again, that's that's your whole livelihood. If if it wasn't for the weak, the weak and infirm, David, you probably would have you you wouldn't exist. So again, give up your scam, give up your cult, let these people go home, stop manipulating these people. Okay, it's it's disgusting, David. What you're doing is disgusting, and you seem to you seem to think it's okay and that you're going to get away with it, but you're not. Okay, so again, that was just a quick update, you guys. Um, the fact that he's doing this, you know, it's it's got to stop. It's got to stop, man. It's it's going on too long. So again, David, you're a piece of shit, man. You're backed into a corner. That's why you're not putting out anything live. I was actually on your Zoom meeting tonight too for a little bit. I, all I asked if the sound, if anybody was having sound issues and I got kicked. And you know what? I really was having sound issues. I couldn't hear anything. And not to mention, I was able to tell that, you know, you guys aren't doing live shows anymore because of when you switched over on YouTube tonight is what you've seen is you could actually see the computer screen from where you guys are running your reruns from. So that's just showing me that you guys, you know, I, you guys are backed into a corner. No doubt about it. And somebody pointed that out, that we have you backed into a corner. And the reason you're not coming out is because you're, you're a scared little baby, David. You're probably, you're hiding somewhere. And you're probably backed into a corner telling Michelle, you know, Why is she putting all these videos out for me? Tell him to take those videos down, Michelle, and put a copyright claim on those videos because she's violating my privacy. David, dude, get over it. Get over it. I told you, I'm going to be in, I'm going to be in your life until you take, all your channels down. And I know you got my email this morning. 
and that email stands. You want me to take, you want me to stop putting videos up? Take all your channels down, all of them. Put apology videos out to everybody that you fucked over and I'll, and I'll stop doing videos. Sound like a deal? Although I don't think you're gonna do that, so I'm gonna keep putting videos out for you. So again, guys, have a good evening, David Taylor. You're a piece of shit.